In this week's episode of Branded, two photographers compete for a $5,000 photography contract. They will have limited resources. We're gonna have you both take off your lenses, turn them into the box, and switch them over for your designated prime lenses. Limited time. Two, one, time. And must create the best 15 photo portfolio for the natural beauty shop, Finland. Two, three. This is so cool. Take this right here. The time is not plenty and resources are little. To the products later because that's going to give us at least like some extra time to think about what, what to do. We have to literally work our ass off to make something nice happen. Who will then award the $5,000 contract to the photographer they want to work with. These are the pictures that, that I did today. Yeah. I hope you like it. This week's brand is the Natural Beauty Shop Finland, located in downtown Helsinki. As customers enter the Natural Beauty Shop Finland, they are met with the wonderful smell of hand-poured soaps and a colorful array of handcrafted items from East Africa. The Natural Beauty Shop Finland combines the feel of an East African open market and provides the quality of a Western-style store. It is the photographer's job to combine all of these attributes into their portfolio to present to the shop owners. We started seven years ago and we are selling organic cosmetics made in Finland and fair trade handcrafts from East Africa. Our products provide a healthy alternative to the harmful chemicals used in many curly and afro hair products. We want our customers when they walk into our shop that they feel colorful, natural environment stocked with high quality products. Our products are vegan and they are specifically designed for eco-friendly and ethic conscious people. Should I look to the camera or yeah, to you? Yeah, that's why I'm Yeah, no, because I didn't know where to look. No, I can, I can look to the camera if, even if you are there, you can't stay there. Well, it's, it's quite difficult to be a, a portrait photographer in Helsinki. It's, um, there are a lot of good photographers in Finland. There is a lot of good photographers in Helsinki. Hi, my, my name is Ricardo and I've been photographing for quite long. But photography for seriously, for serious, I started about nine years ago. 14 years, I started with a film camera and then moved on to digital cameras until now. Hi, I'm Bishar Sawan. I'm a wedding and lifestyle photographer and I'm living in Helsinki. Well, before the COVID, it was working really good, but of course we know that uh, now it's inside two years, it was terrible a bit. Winning the contract for me, it's mean a lot. And of course, it's given me a big push, especially in Corona time. Before the photographers can jump into these challenges, they'll need to answer a series of questions. Correct answers will increase their time on sets, their budgets, and most importantly, decide which of the photographers gets to choose the models they work with. Welcome, gentlemen, to the pilot episode of the Photography Challenge Show where you will both be competing for a $5,000 contract for the Natural Beauty Shop Finland. At the end, you will present a 15 photo portfolio to the brand owner, who will then determine which of you will win the contract. You will both be competing in three separate challenges. One here is going to be lifestyle shot inside the studio. Another, you're going to be given a budget, which you will go downtown, find the products that you would like to have with it, and then shoot your product photo. You can only use props from the budget to do it. And then the final challenge, you'll be going downtown to link the city of Helsinki to the products and the store itself. So for the first unofficial challenge, we're gonna have you both take off your lenses and turn them into the box and switch them over for your designated prime lenses. And you're gonna be stuck with your prime lenses that you have pre-selected. So go ahead and surrender your lenses to the box and pick up your prime lenses. I didn't plan anything, just I knew that the products are uh, natural, so I just 
all what I wanted to go for its totally natural uh, environment. I'm very bad on having plans. I'm actually really awful having plans. My plan usually is not having a plan. So we're going to roll to our first question, which will then decide which of you gets to choose your models. Go ahead and take the chalkboards. So we are looking for a specific year. The closer you get, the more time you'll get on set, and whoever's closest will end up choosing the models they work with. In what year was the digital camera first invented? I knew that uh, the consumer digital cameras went to the market late 80s, early 90s. I was so obviously thinking that it would have been at least like 15 to 20 years. Now while you're thinking about it, this camera was about the size of a toaster, weighed eight and a half pounds, recorded to a cassette tape, and was played back on a TV. All right, time's up. 1890. All right, 1890 and 1978. Well, Ricardo, you are the closest. The correct answer is 1974, when a Kodak engineer named Steve Sasson invented the first digital camera. So, Bisher, you will not get any extra time on set, and you'll be stuck with 15 minutes for your lifestyle photos. So, Ricardo, you were the closest, and you've gained an extra 11 minutes on set for your lifestyle photos. We're going to bring in the models now, and Ricardo, you're going to be able to choose the couple that you would like to work with for the remainder of the shoots. So, models, come on in and introduce yourselves. I'm Annabelle and I'm a professional Latin dancer, so I have been in front of camera all my life. I've been dancing since I'm three. It's just all my life, <laughs> in front of camera and dancing, that's it. So my name is Laura McKinnon. I got into modeling through ballroom dancing, which I've been doing my entire life. So my name is Inicio de Carvalho, I'm 24 years old and I'm from Brazil. People have always telling me that I should start, that I would look good on the cameras. And I've never really tried so much, but now, lately, with my friends talking about this stuff more, I got into it and I'm pretty excited. So hi, my name is Emerson Santos and I got into modeling when I was seven years old, back in Brazil. And I have been studying modeling, arts and dance for maybe 14 years. And Ricardo, which of the two would you like to work with the remainder of the challenges? Emerson and Annabelle. All right. And Bisher, you're going to be working with Vinny and Laura. And now we're going to break for 10 minutes. You get to decide how you're going to go about taking the rest of the shots. 10 minutes starts now. Uh, the reason why I chose especially Emerson is because I already knew him from before. I haven't met him. My fashion and, and portrait photography, I have connected with him on, on, on Instagram earlier. And we are actually planning to have a photo shoot together. So it was actually a good uh, coincidence that he was uh, on a photo shoot. And it was also excellent that I won and I could choose him for the team. Uh, I don't like just take yeah. normal photos, yeah. I would like that so which have meaning, I which have something like, different. Yeah, yeah, something different. Yeah. Because we, I can't take photos from like this, but I want something to photo And then we move to, to the products later, because that's going to give us at least like some extra time to think about what, what to do, how to do, when we can be gone. So we, we buy a bit of time with that, let's take the advantage we have. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And if you have any ideas, you can, we can always discuss it. If we can, I don't know if we can find and trees with leaves, but we could maybe yeah. Yeah. Like use the leaves. Want to see I was kind of, I was kind of, I was kind of first because those are kind, those are African products that we should most likely do it somewhere by the nature. So those ten minutes, I pretty much spend uh, telling them that we were a team. We are working together. We are thinking together. If you have any idea that we should try, that we should work. We go for it. Now, both teams break for the first challenge. Ricardo and his team will stay in the studio and take the lifestyle photos, while Bisher will head to the field to get his product photos. Ricardo instantly set to work setting up his flash and getting ready to start taking his photos inside the studio. I Baby, it's the right thing already, you know. And if we 
it's so and, it's and you like drop it. Yeah. On oh, hand. nice. Yeah. Okay. So but let me. I need to make it the first. It One, two, three. <laughs> One, two, three. Yes. Oh. Good. Yes. Look. This is so cool. <laughs> I wanted to buy some time to think what we were going to do with the product photography because I was quite unsure about. So that was the reason that we would buy time in the studio that while shooting, we would have the gears working already step ahead to think what would be the best move next. This is what we can do. We're gonna use this white thing here. We're gonna have to wipe it and make it nice. And we use the red bricks. So we can get like a plant or something that we can put it in here just to ornate the thing and we add the, the, uh, the products in here and, and we go from that. Okay. I think that is the simpler and more effective that we can do it like on, on the go and okay. it should look quite good. Yes. The problem is the shop to be open. Are you it, it's start today. Yeah, it's start time. We have until five o'clock to actually get the thing from Lochitani if we do. Yeah. But probably Forum is going to be open until five o'clock or something like that. This is the biggest problem we have. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Oh, Just like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it will come um, these nature things with the product and the background will be. Mm -hmm. Let's get the props, let's get some candles, and see whatever we can do. Hopefully we can come up with something nice. Fingers crossed. We never know because time is not plenty and resources are little. So we have to literally work our ass off to make something nice happen. But this is the thing, creativity. But the plan is to find whatever we can find with the candles, sizes, form, forms, whatever, but very earth tones. Okay. Reds browns, everything that goes okay. to the herb that we can mix with the brick on the house okay. and kind of, you know, mix that up. Okay. So we keep that going, it, it, it might make a difference. Okay. So when we uh, went go out to do the product uh, photos, um, I didn't buy anything because I was thinking that we uh, can use the outside environment like leaves, flowers, trees, something like this because it's belong for the product. I didn't want anything like uh, plasticky or anything like uh, not made from nature. Like your hand down, like you are holding okay. like this. Like this. And relax your hand. Okay. And I'm trying not to hold your face between you. Yes. One, two, three. Okay, I'm going to select the fly. Lucky enough that we had this beautiful uh, brick wall in the, uh, in the studio and this white sort of platform that we could use as sort of a table. So we decided that it would be nice to put some plants, use the brick on the back that it's like this earth tone uh, to the picture and use the products that would have the same kind of tone. Then we decided to add a few candles just to, you know, to add some details and some colors and and that was about it you know just cross the fingers and hope for the best right. i don't need anything yes this up more 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 no like here this from here okay one one two three i love this one more which like a closer yeah so this one i like it yeah but we can see them in the computer. Yeah. Okay, let's go. When we've been inside and we had only 50 minutes uh, to take the photos, uh, actually it went really good. Uh, and I didn't use uh, almost any flashes or anything that we used the uh, natural light which came from outside the window because we had a big window. And I really liked it there, it went really good. I don't even have to. <laughs> I'm starting to laugh.
had both completed the studio and product photos, they were then released for an hour into downtown Helsinki. Yeah, there is a sort of deck just there that we can shoot. We can shoot towards to the nature, to the houses there. There's not that deck over there. Actually, it looks pretty cool. It looks nice. With the like earrings? Yeah. yeah. Really? We're going to take the pictures together with you, but we take some pictures only, only you. Only. When we went uh, to take the photos in uh, downtown, it went really good, just a bit uh, showering, raining, <laughs> uh, but it didn't uh, go bad, so we just took what we took, and we had fun actually in the city. Yes. You can look at you if you want. Look at here, at me. Make a look. Yeah. One, two, three. Black, should uh, that thing to be nice? No, it, don't worry now, right now. I'm gonna take pictures of her by herself later. That I'm going to do. You're gonna push us to water? Oh, well, that didn't occur to me, but now that you gave the idea, why not? <laughs> <laughs> Yes, perfect. Let's go. On to the tree, yeah. Sort of. Keep quiet, I think. You're not gonna shout to her. But do it for you! Yeah. They, they gave like many ideas and I was listening to them and trying everything. I have a nice idea. No, I don't. Uh, he wants to leave so with me. I'll hold her from here. Up. She's yeah. gonna have her hands on my shoulders and then gonna be looking at each other like this. Try again, try again, try again. Almost worked. It's, it, it, it's a good idea. Three, go. So you're like joking with him, you want to put to his face and he's like... Oh, okay. What about this? I have to be back. One. One. Two. Feet as him, like this. You, yeah, nice. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. Both teams finished their downtown photos and came back to the studio for editing. They were both given only 40 minutes to edit their 15 photo portfolio, after which they would present to Topi. Having 40 minutes to to edit for me it was a nightmare i mean uh, of course that it's a good thing to have restricted time because you have to act fast but i would probably had presented especially the product pictures and the couple pictures way uh, better edited you know the edit that i presented was the best of what i could in given such a short notice, but definitely not I would present in a professional way if I would have more time. For the edit, when we had uh, 40 minutes, uh, it wasn't that bad. Just, I think I didn't edit them for the max like how usually I do. I just made them normal to be fine and good to look. Actually, I had almost eight photos which I wanted to add, but I had to take them away because uh, we had only 15 photos. Well, my album, I think I was satisfied because especially it's uh, about natural products and most of the photos which I had, it's about nature and uh, flowers, trees and 
good environment around? Well, I was conf confident on the sense that they were good pictures. Absolutely. I, I, I don't think that there were bad pictures and I'm pretty sure that Bisher was, you know, feeling about the same. But if I was confident about my album presenting to Toppy, uh, no, I was not confident at all. Hello, Hi. Toppy. So, Hello, Ricardo. These are the pictures that, that I did today. Yes. I hope you like it. You know, you never know when you're actually presenting something to someone. It's that point where no matter how good you think you did or how bad you think you did, you're adding an element of subjectivity that don't, don't depend on you. It, it depends on someone else. For sure, do we have to choose 15 uh, mm. photos? So I had a lot of nice photos, but, mm. and it was uh, so difficult to choose of them. Yeah. Which ones I want. <laughs> yeah, for <laughs> sure. Because uh, I had a really nice shots with the models. The whole idea that I had was pretty much like to have the couple together, mm -hmm. like having a good time and yeah. trying to get the more that sort of uh, more family feeling for, mm -hmm. for the product. It would have been mm -hmm. even nicer if we would have kids around, which would make it even better. Everything here used natural. Yes. So it's same similar like the product. Mm -hmm. So this is the first one. Mm -hmm. um, it's in the garden. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That I got from, from the inside shop. Yes. All right, these ones with the product. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so it's one of the the options that we have too. Mm. Then these are like the product pictures, mm. like straight product pictures. So for these ones, I was really going for proper like product uh, setting. And also for this case, I had to drop one of your products because the color scheme didn't fit. The blue one wouldn't fit to the picture. Mm. So I had to take it away to make it the thing more, yeah. uh, with more harmonious. Okay, and uh, also same location we took other style yes and then here between the building in helsinki we found this cool place mm. it's really nice yeah it looks mm. good mm. i like this uh, how it's looked like mm -hmm. yeah when i sit with uh, toppy i was a bit nervous actually i don't know why i'm usually relaxing every time and i used for like uh, photograph things and to be relaxing with people, but I don't know why I was uh, a bit nervous. That's it, I hope you enjoy and yes. fingers crossed. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Let's see. And this is the last shot, I think. Yeah, it is the last shot while we're drinking coffee yeah. on the coffee shop table. We found really nice lighting from the window, mm -hmm. so just... Love yeah, it. this one I like because the products are really clear and they are yeah. presented mm. well there in the, in the front. Yeah, exactly. That's why I, I like this one. Mm. Uh, but these for now like uh, what we have. Hopefully you like them. Mm -hmm. Yes, I like them. Mm. There are, there's many, many good photos mm. in there. And I like the idea about the nature. Yeah. Bringing the nature there because they are natural products. Exactly. Mm. Hope you like them and I hope you like the style of it. Yes. Mm. I have to say that uh, they, they are, I mean, they are different. They, 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 are, they have different kind of approach, especially those product photos. I mean, they both have really nice uh, photos with the, with, the, with the couple, with the models, just the models by themselves. Well, it's, it's a hard, hard uh, question. I mean, hard, hard, um, I think to choose, they are both really good. I like both of them, they are very, very professional and you could see that they have put their effort into them. All right, Toby, come to a conclusion and where can the people at home find your products? You can find our products at naturalbeautyshop.fi. I wasn't very sure if, if he would actually, uh, if he would actually buy the idea that I had about, you know, color grading for the pictures and giving that sort of mood that I gave for the pictures. I, I, it, it, it was literally a, a shot in the dark. Yes, our products are organic and natural, and that's obviously what uh, I was looking about the, in the products. And um, there was a first, if I first talk, for example, Ricardo's photos, um, 
I like the, the photos with the uh, the couples. I mean the couple together. Yeah. There was a nice warm atmosphere. Uh, the product photos, I like them. There was, uh, for example, the one that had this this photo in front. I especially like that one. The black and white wasn't so much what I was looking for. It was a bit like a, they were real, they were good, but maybe they wouldn't work with the with these products. And then Pisher, I liked also your photos of the of the couples together. You had this urban feeling there. Of the product photos, I liked your last photo the best, mm -hmm. where the products were together, but they were really clear, mm -hmm. clearly presented. Also, in your photos, there were some photos that wasn't quite what I was looking for. Can't uh, can't say so clearly that which one, but some of them were clearly better than the other ones. Uh, I liked both of your fo photos, but I still liked Ricardo your photos more. Somehow there was uh, one or two photos that was uh, like uh, the, the couples together on the window pane, they were really good, the feeling was really nice. And then that one photo with, with this photo in front, that made like, I could definitely work work with you. Oh, great. Yes. <laughs> but I have to say that, Peter, your photos are really excellent also. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Good job, both of you. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, when we uh, went to sit down and to hear the winners, actually it was so excited and I just surprised because I was wondering who we gonna win and it was really nice to uh, hear it in the end. And of course, uh, I lost on that uh, point, but it doesn't matter, it's his choice. <laughs> Like I say, it, it, it depends on subjectivity. It could have it, it could have swung for both sides. It could have been Bisha on the blink of an eye. It, uh, it was good. It was nice. I, I, I was happy, obviously. I was pro... I can almost say that I was more happy for the team than for myself. I, I, I take pride on a win, but at the same time, it came a lot more for the people that had put a lot of effort to make that happen.